Another reason to get out and get some sun. When it's there, of course. A new study shows a lack of the vitamin that is linked to sunlight could be making a growing number of Canadian children sick. Jennifer Tryon explains. It's grey Canadian days like this. Researchers believe may be robbing Canadian kids of a natural defense against type 1 diabetes, vitamin D. They're both very fair haired, so uh, you know we load them up with sunscreen and hats uh, when they go outside. So that was obviously more of a concern than, than the vitamin D deficiency. His son Peter has type 1, or juvenile diabetes, and until now, he never thought the disease was something that could be prevented. And it tells it my blood sugar. But a new study published today suggests Canadian kids, because of geography and climate, are at increased risk of developing type 1. Rates of type 1 diabetes in countries closest to the sun are between 1 and 3 cases for every 100,000 people. But the further away a child lives from the equator, the higher the incidence. And the risk goes up again when you get north of 55 degrees latitude, about the level of Edmonton, especially if you've got darker skin. Approximately 35 times higher at high latitudes than at low latitudes. Vitamin D is like a shield that protects vital insulin-producing cells. When the vitamin D levels are low, the cells are vulnerable to attack. When vitamin D is gone, the body will be dependent on insulin for life. If we were to provide adequate vitamin D supplementation, we wouldn't see the disease anymore. It would become irrelevant. In fact, those who supplement with vitamin D cut their risk of type 1 diabetes by nearly 30%. Beginning about birth should receive 1,000 international units a day. But that's a recommendation contested in Canada. The Pediatric Society only recommends 400 international units with no plans for an increase. Right. But what's worse the is nobody does it. These Toronto diabetes researchers are frustrated parents aren't listening to the recommendations. And if there's something that you can do that's really easy that prevents it, then why not do these things? Give your vitamin D. Every morning now with breakfast, a tablet, especially for Peter's sister. So we want to make sure that we're doing everything we can that she's not going to get it. Evidence also shows that those who have already had their first attack leading to, a type 1 leading to type 1 diabetes can reverse the disease by getting more vitamin D.